Consider changing his surname to which British city? A or B? Um, I'll go with A. Right, get ready, Belinda. In the early days of his double act with Eric Morecambe, Ernie Wise considered changing his surname to which British city? Leeds. That's what it says. I would never say that. We've had Yang Wang and Eric Lee. It is. Honest. It's in the easy, isn't it? Well, you just said Leeds, so. don't you make up your mind yet. Here's your third and final question. This one has to go to Jordan. On average, nearly 177,000 people in the UK do what each day? Right. Believe it or not, do yoga. Oh, come on, do we believe in this guy? Right, I can see you trying to work out from what you've heard. So we'll have a little recap and it may help you out. First up, I ask, what was the name of the Chinese inventor of the electronic cigarette? And without hesitation, Dane said, Yang Wang. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's see you next one. In the early days of his double act with Eric Morecambe, Ernie Wise considered changing his surname to which British city? And Belinda said, Leeds. This one, on average, nearly 177,000 people in the UK do what each day? And Jordan said, do yoga. Yes. Well, this is an interesting one, considering yes. that your prize is yoga. Yeah, so it could be sort of related to prize, couldn't it? Well, well the thing is, right, you yeah. said you were good at trying to work out people. Go through them for me. Yes, well, I think she is trying a bit too hard. She's eager to try and convince me. That I was going to say Blackpool, and then Leeds has come up. You don't have to believe me, but it is in here, and I want you to win your prize. I'm not going to lie. Well, I mean, you don't have to believe you, Belinda. That's the problem. So, what about Jordan? My last two answers, I'll admit, were not very good. But uh, this one is definitely, I want you to do yoga at the shop. It looks like an amazing experience. It's right here. It's not Eric Leeds, is it? Come on. Let's hear from Dane. How bad do you want us to want to do yoga? Because you've got to... I've got the answer, so... So, so come and help her out. A, B, or C. Right. It's your call. Which one are you going with? A, because they must be yeah, going with A. Right. So lots of people with their hands on the heads. But before we do anything, Belinda, you've won a thousand pounds. Now, Belinda has convinced you that she has got the prize and she read the answer leads from her screen. This is the most split the audience has ever been. But you felt there was just a couple more saying A for Belinda. But was Belinda hiding the Penguin's prize? No one in this studio can work it out. But we're going to find out in three minutes. <laughs>